Hello, my name is Rod Metcalf, and I'm the Machine Learning Product Manager here at Cadence. During this video, we're going to discuss why more automation for chip designs is necessary and how the Cadence Cerebrus Intelligent Chip Explorer delivers power, performance and area and productivity improvements for the chip design process. New applications and technology are driving demand for even more compute and functionality in the devices we use every day. The semiconductor industry is experiencing strong growth based on technologies like 5G, autonomous driving, hyperscale compute, industrial IoT, and many others. System-on-chip designs are quickly migrating to new process nodes and rapidly growing in size and complexity. Engineering teams are overloaded and need help to keep up with the ever-increasing design starts. The reality is future chips have to be produced faster with more automation. Improving productivity has a long history in chip design. When chip design first started it, each transistor was created and connected up manually in a full custom layout editor, which was a very time consuming process. To improve the efficiency of digital chip design, we moved to a standard cell and schematic netlist methodology. This enabled engineers to implement logic blocks much more quickly, but creating a schematic netlist took by hand took a lot of effort. As desktop Unix workstations became available, each engineer suddenly had access to a lot more compute power, so RTL synthesis became practical. Now chip designers could capture digital logic functions using high-level languages like VHDL and Verilog, and quickly synthesize a netlist of millions of gates. This was a massive leap forwards in productivity, enabled by desktop compute power. But this presented the next problem, how to lay out millions of standard cells. So along with RTL synthesis, automated place and route systems were developed, so large net lists could be quickly implemented. This was another significant productivity improvement. However, since then, not much has changed with the chip design process. During the past few years, two key technologies have become available, which will enable the next big leap forwards in chip design productivity. First, engineering teams have access to massive compute power, either on premises or using cloud resources. Second, machine learning computer science has made significant progress and is now ready and available for electronic design automation. Both these technologies have enabled the next big leap forwards in chip design, automated machine learning driven flow optimization. Introducing Cerebrus, the future of intelligent chip design. Cerebrus is built on these massive compute and machine learning architectures. Cerebrus uses a unique reinforcement machine learning engine developed here at Cadence to deliver better design performance, power and area results. By using a completely automated machine learning driven RTL to GDS full flow optimization technology, Cerebrus can deliver better PPA results more quickly than a manually tuned flow, which improves engineering team productivity. And Cerebrus user uses the latest scalable and distributed computing technology, either on-premises or cloud computing resources, to enable efficient and scalable chip design for the ever-increasing size and complexity of today's systems on chip designs. Let's take a look at how Cerebrus can improve productivity. The red line shows the current manual iterative flow development process. Designers create an initial flow, run the design to generate some results, and based on these results, decide what to change, and then run the flow again. This requires a lot of engineering effort and is generally an inefficient use of compute resources, and often will not result in the best PPA. Even if you add a lot more engineers to the team, PPA may not improve that much. By moving to Cerebrus, the whole green curve moves to the left. Compared to the manual iterative process, Cerebrus can use automated reinforcement learning driven full flow optimization to generate better PPA more quickly, improving the engineering team productivity and making more effective use of the available compute resources. If you'd like to understand more about how Cerebrus reinforcement learning flow optimization works, please take a moment to view the Cerebrus R&D video. Let's take a look at some recent Cerebrus results. This is a typical 5 nanometer high performance 3.5 gigahertz CPU design. The customer used Cerebrus to automatically optimize the implementation flow to improve power and performance. You can see the results are quite significant with a 420 megahertz performance improvement and also good power reduction. 
This was achieved by one engineer using Cerebrus for about two weeks. If the customer tried this flow tuning manually, it would have taken many engineers a few months, and even then it's questionable if the PPA results would have been achieved manually. This is a great example of the productivity benefits Cerebrus enables. Another interesting example is how Cerebrus can use built-in systems to do high-level design optimization. This is a 12 nanometer, 2 gigahertz CPU design, and the customer wanted to use Cerebrus to optimize the floor plan and implementation flow for better power and performance. Using the floor plan optimization system, Cerebrus was able to dynamically change the size and aspect ratio of the floor plan and use the Innovus Mixed Placer technology to relocate the macros in the resized floor plan completely automatically. This resulted in over 200 megahertz better CPU performance with a good reduction in leakage power. Cerebrus was able to come up with an optimized floor plan much more quickly than a manual iterative approach could achieve. A number of customers are already benefiting from Cerebrus full flow optimization technology. For example, Renesis used Cerebrus as they develop new products on emerging process nodes and have already seen success with the floor plan optimization capability. Also, as part of their design technology co-optimization program, Samsung Foundry are using Cerebrus to quickly develop flows for new process nodes. So to conclude with, Cerebrus is the next revolution in chip design. Using a unique reinforcement machine learning engine developed by Cadence, Cerebrus delivers better design power performance and area results more quickly. Cerebrus provides completely automated, machine learning driven, full flow optimization technology, which enables better engineering team productivity, so more system on chip designs can be implemented concurrently. And Cerebrus uses the latest scalable and distributed computing technology, either on premises or cloud computing resources to enable efficient and scalable chip design for the ever-increasing size and complexity of today's products. As I mentioned earlier, if you'd like to understand more about how Cerebrus reinforcement learning flow optimization works, please take a moment to view the Cerebrus R&D video. Cerebrus is truly the future of intelligent chip design. Many thanks for your time and interest watching this video.